it goes himself. Great play out the back of the half. Settling in really well so far. Um, been good to get to know, know all the boys. Be good to be based in the one place for you know for the future now. Um, the summer is quite tough travelling around a lot, but good to get settled in here in Bath um, for me and my family. But the boys have made it so much easier. Um, been very accommodating, getting to know me, and so it's been been, been good fun. Um, for the rugby side, it's been quite a smooth transition, I think. I'm enjoying Bath so far. That's a bit smaller, but it's nice just going into the town, walking around, it's only a 10 minute drive in for us, so going in and just finding little cafes, little coffee shops, and having a, a little daughter now, that's it's nice being able to, to enjoy a slightly calmer life. Um, albeit when it comes to the, the training and the, the games, it's the same as, as what I've been used to for the last 10, 12 years now. So I think the main thing that drew me to the club was, was getting to know you and seeing the, the recruitment over the last year or two. I play with Cam and and Ruri and Josh at, at Scotland, so hearing what, what they say it's like down here at Bath, what the boys are like, what the team's like, what the environment's like, it's probably what drew me here, here to Bath. That was a, a, real, uh, a real pull for me to get here, was, was the coaching staff, the players, but also just the, the experience of playing in the Premiership as well. So as much as I'm here to play and win as much as I can, I'm also here to, to help the young boys and try and develop them as, as much as I can without trying to enforce too much in them as they're, they're great players already. Working with Cam, we've got a really good relationship and I'm looking forward to, to building on that, but also getting to know some of the other younger players, whether it's Orlando at 10 or Sam at 10 or Max at, at 12 or 13, depends where. But working with, with Ben at 9 as well. Um, so there's some younger players, but also some, some good experienced players that I'm looking forward to working with. It is an early welcome for Finn Russell after just 31 minutes. He makes his Bath debut. Yeah, I think the, the reason for me coming straight back in, I spoke with Yuan um, after the Ireland game and said I was keen to get straight back in. Being a, a Bath player for, for three months or so, um, without actually being here, I was, I was excited to get back in, see what it's like and, and get settled in fully. I could have taken time off potentially and just dwelled in the World Cup and what hadn't been for us, but I was keen to get back in here, get onto the new, get into the new chapter and, and start going straight away. So. You know, I was buzzing just to get straight back in here and, and get off the bench and, and get stuck into it. So um, it was made a lot better by the boys' performance, getting five points win at home in the first game of the year. It was great fun getting out there and and interacting with the fans after the game as well. So I think the the crowd really give us life and I hope that the way that we've been, been playing this year, that's that's going to get you all off your seat and get you cheering on for us. So um, I think it's been, been great fun so far and I'm looking forward to, to creating an even more exciting atmosphere at the rec. Chatting with other boys um, in the Scotland camp about playing the Premiership, they talk about the Prem intensity and how it's, it's full on. I'm looking forward to the, the challenge that the Premiership has for me as an individual but also as, as a team as we build this year. I played against the teams in, in Champions Cup before and um, they're always really tough teams to come up against and especially Bath. I played here with Glasgow in a Champions Cup game so the following that you have and the fans that we have here it's a great atmosphere and a great team to play for and a great group of fans to play for. Down here in the southwest, there are there are a lot of derby games. Um, Bristol is probably the closest one, um, but also you've got Gloucester, Leicester, Exeter that aren't far away either. So these are massive occasions for for the club and for the for the league. So I'm looking forward to, to experiencing these as the, the season goes on. I've got a couple of mates that play in different teams. At Gloucester, there's a couple of boys, a couple of guys at Bristol, Exeter. So as much as it'll be a challenge for the the team to win, for me it's a kind of personal one against your mates having having a shot against them. So these are, are huge games for the club as are derbies, but I think as a, an individual when you're playing against your mates, it's always a good bit of fun as well. So I'm looking forward to, to these games coming in over the next few weeks and hopefully getting the wins. Playing the Tigers this weekend, that'll be my first experience for a derby game for Bath. Especially at home, I'm looking forward to seeing what the atmosphere is like at the stadium, what the build-up that week is into it. And especially on the pitch for us boys, um, how, we, how we, can, we can perform in that game and how well we can play. So. Um, this will be my first derby game, um, although there's a few more to come in the, the next few weeks, but I'm looking forward to, to getting stuck into this one and, and hopefully we get, get the winner uh, against Leicester. <laughs>